Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Marisa. In today's video, I am so, so excited. I have been waiting for this box since January. It's not late, it's on time. This is a box from Sacred Vibes, and I think it is the Sacred Wheel box, I believe. They have two boxes, a monthly and the Sacred Wheel of the Year box. So I think this is what this is. I am dying to open it up and share it with you. Highly anticipated for months. I am so excited. So let's get started with the unboxing. Hey guys, so how is everyone doing? Um, if you're new here, welcome to my channel. My name is Marisa and yeah i have been waiting for this box for months it, they do like a pre-sale um unfortunately i missed the next one they sold out so i got lucky with this one i've never gotten one of their boxes before but i have seen unboxings from other channels um especially enchanted moon uh, she does great unboxings i was like wow this box looks really really cool and if you hear a little noise in the background i have the air conditioner on because it's really hot today it went from 50 degrees to 70. anyway all right so i got my beep 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 wonderful scissors and let's and then of course it's like afternoon now because i've been waiting all morning for it and now all the kids are coming out of school and so it's gonna be a little um, noisy out all right so let's open her up okay oh, I think I have it upside down I was trying to hide my address so let's pull it out all right and let's Flip it over. Oh, okay. Nice. So I don't, yeah, I don't know. So I know that on the website, the one I got, this may not be um, the Wheel of the Year because it said on the package, Sacred Wheel. But I know when I had bought this, it said Inner Goddess. It's something about Goddess. So I'm, because I had saw this beautiful picture of this like green goddess so i don't care what it is it's like i'm so excited to open this all right so let's open it up Ooh, okay so i'm excited so here is what it says they always do like nice um like little stickers on the box itself it says magic is in you and the goddess will help claim it nice so okay so here's like a little your order gave us good vibes and okay so here is some of their information here all right now this is paperwork and i heard they give a lot of paperwork so i'm not going to look at this yet um yeah, I'm not going to look at this yet because it's going to make, it'll probably give me like spoilers. All right, I'm really excited because I, I was like, did I get the Wheel of the Year one for Astara or did I get what I got? You know what I mean? Like I was hoping like I got the Goddess one, but either one I would have been happy. Like if I accidentally got the Astara one. So oh, let me not, I don't want to rip this very cute sticker. Okay, it's a triple goddess sticker. You know what? My air conditioner is making like it starts. It's starting to rumble, which is annoying. I will be right back. I just want to like shut it off real quick. Okay, sorry guys. All right, sorry guys. I don't want like a lot of a lot of background noise. So, okay. So there's the paperwork. We're gonna put that to the side, and I'm probably not gonna read every single thing, obviously some beautiful gold paper and this beautiful little triple goddess sticker here and what does it say magic is in you and the goddess will help claim it so ooh, okay oh my god all right <sighs> what is going on all right so right already on top what is this 
I am excited. Holy cow. Can I can I do this with these stupid nails? I don't want to cut it. Let's see if I can. Hold on. All right, I got it. Figured it out. Okay. What is this? Oh my Oh my god, this is inner. That's so cool. Uh, I'm gonna have to like roll it the other way. Hold on, let me just roll it the other way. So it lays a little more flat. Woo! So it says inner goddess journal and it's in a binder and that's cool because I have like, I have a binder, um, a grimoire, but this is a journal. Oh my God. Hello goddess. <gasps> Look at this. Look at this. Oh, wow. Holy cow. Okay. S wow. So it gives you... It's a little hard to keep open. Sorry. It gives you all these journaling exercises. Wow. This is amazing. Hold on. Let me just... Okay. Oh, this is very cool. It gives you all these journaling prompts. There's literally, I think it's like a whole, it seems like it's like a month. Yep. It's so like day 20. I'm sorry, guys. This is really hard to keep open. Wow. So this is literally a whole month's worth of like journaling prompts for every day. Oh, wow. A vision board. They give you information, like, ideas for a vision board. Look at her, she is beautiful. This is, all right, I love this box. This is so cool. Um, I wish they laid it flat because it's gonna be a pain in the butt to kinda undo it. But the more I do it the opposite way, it'll lay more flat. And I'll probably put some, this is so awesome. This is so awesome. Wow, this is like a sign because I just did, um, today's a full moon, today's Friday, and I just did like a whole full moon um, ceremony, like ritual, and I kept on, I just kept on getting like hints to like connect to my inner goddess, connect to my feminine, the divine feminine, and this is like, telling me a lot it's like it's like for me it's a sign all right so I'm just push I just push the box back so here we got this beautiful bracelet and it's Dalmatian Jasper and I do not have any uh, Dalmatian Jasper this is really beautiful look at this gorgeous tag Dalmatian Jasper grounds you spiritually and provides stability to help you conquer anything most of the grounding energy comes from the black tourmaline spots. Very, very beautiful. I love that. That is gorgeous. Love it. Okay, so far, wow. Just with the book on top. Okay. Next, we have a beautiful necklace. A beautiful triple goddess charm necklace and it says here what does it say sorry guys what i can't read the font something about the maiden love like the mother and think like the crone okay oh i think okay i think it says play like the maiden love like the mother and think like the crone beautiful i absolutely love it Ooh, and some like rune um wow tape very detailed i love that okay next we have some white sage incense cones very nice i like that sabio blanco all right all right this is staring at me right here Okay, this is another book, dude. Wow. Look at this. 
what is going on? Look at how gorgeous this is. Okay, what is this exactly? Oh, wow. Look at this paper. <gasps> this is the journal. Like, okay, so this is beautiful. So they're giving you all these prompts. You can write stuff in here, but they actually... And her name is Gypsy. And I, she makes everything by hand, by the way. So everything here is like, you could, she probably used like a cricket to make this. Like you could tell, like everything is handmade. Wow. This is so beautiful. Gypsy, you did, I know she's probably not gonna look at this, but she did a lovely job. And the paper is so nice beautiful so i have my own goddess journal that is absolutely fantastic i thought this was going to be more like for some reason like on the herbal side like gaia like mother earth that like that kind of feel i didn't think it was gonna be like your inner goddess and now i have the ice cream man <laughs> oh my goodness holy cow Wow, um, hello, this is beautiful. All right, and now we got the ice cream man. Are you serious, dude? I'm gonna let this dude pass by. Uh, I, I almost called everyone by my son's name. All right, this dude's distracting me. I'm gonna let him pass by, I will be right back. All right, the ice cream man is gone. So we have this beautiful white um, votive right here. I don't. If it smells like anything, I don't smell anything, but that's cool. Doesn't Not everything has to have a scent to it. And, all right, so let me how Oh, my God, look how gorgeous. This is a beautiful, gorgeous goddess. Okay, it's already put together, and you just put the top on like that. And you put your incense cones. Wow. This, I do not have anything like this. Of course, I have um, incense holders. I have the ones that it's like, a, you know, um, the wooden long ones with a cover. And you could put a cone and or a stick. But I do not have anything like this. Actually, my son got me the backflow ones. But again, I don't have anything like this. Like, I don't have any goddess um, incense holders. So this is my first one. This is really nice and heavy. Look how beautiful. Wow. I am, um, I am amazed. And then there's something in here. So we have a golden package here. Let's see what it is. Maybe a candle. No, it's not a candle. <gasps> Ooh, it is an oil. <clears throat> Inner goddess oil. Because I was like, where are my herbs? Where are my oils? <laughs> wow. Okay, I'm going to open this. It's, and it has a little, um, a little holder right here. So you can like put it on your keys or something. Or like hook it inside. If you have one of those hooks inside your purse. And I'm going to smell it. Wow. All right, so it is a roller, a roller ball. Look at this beautiful glass bottle. Hmm, I don't know what that is. Is it jasmine? Huh. It may be like a jasmine. This is beautiful. Another gorgeous item. Holy cow, guys, this is lovely. Okay. All right, I think that is, this here is the last item. But I think there's two things here. So we have this, if I can, these nails. All right, let's see if I can do this. Sorry. So sorry. Oh my God, all right the nails i want to look pretty on camera but then i screw myself all right <sighs> come on okay i'm just gonna shove it down <laughs> sorry guys 
So, this looks like possi a possible altar cloth, and it's wrapped in something else. All right, I always save things like this. Okay, let's see what it is. Holy cow, it is a deck. It's an oracle deck, and I don't have this oracle deck. I do not have this. And I love goddess oracle decks. Well, hold, first of all, hold on. So, well, it's not like an altar cloth per se. I guess you can use it as an altar cloth. It's like just like a little piece of cloth. Um, it's not like finished like an altar cloth, but you know what? But this is actually perfect because I have like a self-love altar and this is like the perfect size. This doesn't have to be this huge, um, but this is like an altar cloth. You know, it's just not kind of fancy on the edges, but I don't really care about that. This is lovely. So you have all the different little goddesses here. This is beautiful. I love that. Okay. So we have the Goddess Power Oracle. So I'm not going to show you every card because that will literally take forever. But I'll just like kind of show you a few of the cards. Okay. So I don't see a book that comes with this. Hmm. Maybe. Maybe um, that code. Yeah, I'm probably gonna like check this um, this code out and see if like I get information about. So I don't see like a book to tell you the meanings of it. But anyway, well, you know what? It gives you like a, a word, you know what I mean? And you use it, I use my intuition anyway. Um, I do read the meaning of the cards, but I don't like to fully depend on that uh, for my meaning, if you get my meaning. <laughs> um, you know, I'll look, at the f I'll look at the picture, I'll read who it is, I'll read the word. And then I'll look, and then I'll kind of go deeper into it. But anyway, here are some of the cards. Aphrodite, Ariane, Artemis. So these are very pretty. Athena. I have no idea what the... Benzai Zen? Zen? Okay. Bronwyn. Gorgeous. She's beautiful. Oh, look at Bridget. Caridwin. Yes, and they spell it a little differently. See, I, I had told you she was Caridwin. Now, she's, in my vision, she doesn't look anything like this. But who who's to say what she looks like? But in my, in my mind, she looks like with darker hair and stuff. But Danu... Demeter. All right, so I'm not going to show you every single one, but these are beautiful. Oh, and here. Ostre. I'm sure I'm saying it wrong, but this is for Astara. New beginnings. So we're going to leave it on that. So this is... I don't know, for some reason I thought it was going to be more... I'm not disappointed, mind you. I am not disappointed in this box. I'm really, really happy. I have been waiting for this box since January. I'm really, really happy with it. Um, for some reason, I thought it was going to be more like, kind of like Gaia, a green goddess type of a, a vibe. But I am really happy because I've been building my self-love altar. And I've kind of been like, eh, kind of not... I, I've been adding some other stuff to it, switching stuff out. I just felt like I, I just needed different things to kind of connect me to that particular self-love altar. And I think this is going to really help me a lot doing that. This beautiful, I could put this on my altar 
this is beautiful and connect to my inner goddess. So I am gonna get the paperwork and we're gonna go over that just like really quickly. And yeah, I'll be right back. All right, I am back. I just wanted to kind of lay out everything a little bit better. Let me pull you in a little bit more. There, that's better. I love this. This is like, I was reading the paperwork a little bit. This is like my manifesto. Are you kidding me right now? That is so cool. Okay, so we have a The Goddess Lifestyle Plan Manifesto. I'm just going to read like a couple lines and that's it. I step fully into the life I, I am meant to live. I understand that I am a divine goddess because all women since the beginning of time are goddesses in their essence. I acknowledge that I am part of the earth and one with the universe. That alone makes me divine in my very being and essence. I always listen to the intuitive voice that speaks to me divinely, guiding me to make the best choices for my life and myself. I trust myself completely. That is that. That is freaking, um, this is amazing. All right, so that's that sheet. Now this is a lot, um, and the font is really small and it's kind of light. Um, but yeah, of course, I'm not going to sit here and read all that to you guys because we have quite a few pages. Um, just says practice solitude, feel your beauty, trust the universe to let go. These are just little prompts. Then you have empower other women, release the negative, connect with mother nature, learn to control your energy. Know your boundaries, trust your instinct, create a balanced life. So that is that sheet. And more on the back. Okay, here we go. All right, so this is what's in the box. So we have the triple, uh, triple moon goddess necklace right there. We have the Dalmatian Jasper Stone bracelet. This gorgeous beauty right here. We have the 30 day inner goddess journal. Um, and with that, it says 30 day journal in a flexible binder, 30 days of journal prompts, activities and affirmations to discover and release your inner goddess. And then we have the inner goddess um, body oil. So it says it is made with jasmine. I was right for once, uh, jasmine oil and clear quartz and, and was roses as well. Um, this, this font is really hard to read. It's very light. Um, you can use it to anoint your third eye and ritual tools, wear as a perfume. Um, yeah, so this is what, that was what it was in it. Then we had, so I was right about the jasmine. Then we have the goddess power oracle deck. I love that. The, okay, so it's a goddess votive holder and incense burner. That is very cool. So you can use it as a votive. Beautiful. Or as with the top, you can use it as an incense burner. I love it even more now. Okay, let's see. Um, do, 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 the goddess journal. So we, this beauty right here, this is just amazing. This is gorgeous. We have the incense, the tea light candle, and of course the book of shadows sheets. And there's more information on the back. And then we have the charge of the goddess. So you have all this information here and on the back. Wow, this is a lot. Then they give you information about white candles and, you know, all their associations, white candles. And then I'm sure there's something on the back. Then you got clear quartz. So there, I guess there's clear quartz inside the oil because I saw it said clear quartz and 
I didn't see clear quartz in the box. So there must be, there's clear quartz in the oil itself. And it says cleanse and activate and other uses. And we have a book of shadow sheet about rose and all associations with rose. And we have on the other side, Jasmine. Wow. Um, I was expecting more of a green goddess type of situation with like herbs and stuff, but I am obviously the universe is telling me that this is what I need and not more herbs because I have so many herbs and stuff and I've been looking at that, um, at my, uh, self love altar next to my carriage wind altar and it felt like it was lacking something and now I have these beautiful things I could put I could put on the altar I'm gonna change my altar up a little bit and I can actually really connect to my inner goddess I think or the divine feminine um, and I think that's something I really really need to do um, obviously the universe is telling me that's what I need. So I am really, really happy. So anyway, guys, um, as ah, I don't know what my favorite item is. I know that a lot of people are probably going to say the incense holder. And I think this is really like stunning and really, really useful for me because I, I literally like candles all day and light incense. I do it all the time. I love everything, but I think my two favorite things is because I love to read. I literally just got another book today. <laughs> um, I'm going to show it to you right here because I just came today. Wild Magical Soul. These are all brand new books. Whoop, whoop, sorry. I got The Village Witch. Um, this was recommended to me by um, Sarah's Hecka Lisa. And then I got another book, The Eclectic, which is Book of Shadows. So I literally, I'm a reader um, and I love to write things down and take notes and stuff. So I knocked my camera over for a sec. So for me, my two favorite, my, my favorite items are this the believe it or not I know it's just but it's like I love journal prompts I think that's amazing um, and this gorgeous um, journal here those are my two favorite things um, I think that's great and I'm gonna check to see if I can get like the meanings and stuff to these um, but you know I have another goddess uh, uh, deck and but anyway I'm, I'm more of an intuitive reader anyway and I just love everything. Anyway, guys, that is it for today. I've been rambling long enough. Tell me what is your favorite item? What, what do you love the most? I told you what I loved. And that is it, guys. I hope you enjoyed today's video. I have quite a few more boxes coming towards the middle and the end of the month. And I got stuff planned for April already. I'm really excited about that. So guys, thank you so much for watching today. I hope you enjoyed. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss one of my videos. Give me a big thumbs up. And guys, I will see you in the next one. Bye.